start directing. Yeah, right. And I would like to put a lot of effort into that coming up. Um, I'd like to do my first feature being pregnant. I did a, I did a few shorts being pregnant. Right. And I felt very powerful. Yeah, isn't that amazing? Yeah. I'd like to put a lot of focus into that for the next year. Um, continually producing out projects. Hopefully a second season of Aussie Girl. Yeah. Um, get back to the blog, Bottle and Heels. I have a clothing line, Stella Phoenix, which we're yeah, on our mate, second I collection. I don't know how you have time to do <laughs> anything. All fun and you know projects, what's so sorry, sad? Like... It's so sad because I actually don't think I'm doing enough. Yeah, right. And that's a perfectionist thing. That's yeah. like when I'm like, oh, I could be, you know, yesterday we had 30 interviews and I was like, oh, we can fit a femur in. And it's just unhealthy. Yeah, It's yeah. unhealthy to think that that's not, and then we flew to Melbourne and I was like, oh, that's not even that bad. Right. Do you think it's like it? That's training. I'm probably, thing? but Is I'm also like... probably trained to do it. So it's like I'm trained to just keep going. Yeah, right. You know. Do you also feel that a part of you goes, "This is going to end at some point, so let's do it all now"? I was so afraid of that, but because we're taking control of our life, I feel so much less scared. Right. Right. Because. We can always figure it out. We always have, you know, and the secret that I would tell myself from a very young age is it's always okay. Yeah. Even the bad stuff is always okay. Even the loss when you lose someone or you have a divorce or it, you, you always get through it. You do, yeah, at the time. At the time you don't feel like you are, but you no. always get through it. Yeah, and you get through it in a better way too. You come out yeah. and you're like, if I get through this, I'm going to be a better There's person There's this great book it. called You Were Badass. It's not sponsored or anything, but it's my favorite book. And right. She just talks about every single thing that happens to you can be a positive or a negative. Right. So you miss the plane and you're like, oh my God, I missed the plane. But then it, you could think like, well, it's found time. It's found time to call my daughter. Yeah. It's just like everything that we do is a negative or a positive and it's up to us to choose what that is. I know. I try and do that in the traffic when the traffic shit. It's I'm found like, time. 